You too will you begin. Yes, you do. Andale, andale, vamos. Good job. Good job. Good dog. Okay. Good dog. Hey, how you doing, everybody? Shut the fuck up. I wanted you to know something, okay? And that is this. Today, we're going, as it says in the title, actually, we're going to be renaming a bunch of our critters in our zoo in after that of uh, Rakiti Kapawamp Sanctuary, hopefully, as well as after uh, my brain work, after uh, Tucson Sanctuary down in South Australia. Which is going to be quite nice. There is a spider web that is attached to the top of my... That's not disconcerting at all, is it arachnophobe? Anyway, we're going to pause immediately because I... I took like hours fixing pretty much everything, so there's that. Uh, and yeah, these I believe already have everybody being called. But this is gonna be a really quick stream, so if you're watching this, say, Oh, the Vob, beautiful, wonderful, and all that good stuff. I like how on my phone for preview, so I can actually see how the stream is doing, it auto piloted to 144p. Excuse me, yes, I already did this with them. So, yeah. Also, sadly, Zabumafu died. So, we're gonna need to probably eventually na rename one of these guys, or get a new one and rename it to Zabumafu! Alright, so, let's get to it, shall we? Well, let's start with Ratiti, since we're closest to... Uh, uh, Ratiti. Since we're closest to that of the Heffalumps. Dumaka. Is it good, bro? No, I'm probably gonna read. I'm probably gonna spell some of these names wrong because they are in the native. Some Buru longer than I do, say. But, uh. I believe. Longro. I believe is how they spell that, and that's the most. Famous little guy. Because he has a half a trunk, if you don't mind. Uh, at Oreteti. So we're going to go with that. I don't believe in Wafak I don't believe that that's actually uh, co quite correctly spelled, but it might be. I don't know. How about you, sir? Adovo. Right. So when I left off on the last stream, Spod, I actually uh, said, oh yes, my original, uh, Adofo. But no, it's because I renamed. His, I renamed uh, one of them that I had originally as Adolfo. Or, I mean, Adolfo, because I'm pretty sure... No, no, I did name him. I named his son, his first offspring, Adolfo. Because he's Adolfo, so I figured Adolfo. Good daddy. Um, for the moment, I'm going to leave it as it is. But... I, you say I need to look up. Um, I mean, I could do it right now, but I need to look up more of their uh, their their names because right now I'm not going to remember. So let's quickly go do that, I suppose. Already. What do we have? Uh, let's see. We need a switch. Or we can put people on following. This onto oops rescue. Okay, it's spelled long uro. My bad. And I believe usually in uh, you know, in Afrikaans, I think. But the a lot of the African languages, the apostrophe actually symbolizes a click. The. Uh, Long bro or Uro or something like that. Yeah, I did say I obviously I'm trying, but I don't know what the hell it'd be. So, uh, not you. Uh, it was actually not even a dofo over here. It was a ye. So see, I was uh, my brain was already comp uh, complicating this un un needlessly. And it's not Uro. It's Uro. Oh God. Oh, God, help! Oh, my 
let's see. Do do do. Oops, I'm being a dumbass. Ah, da 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 da. Yes. Let's see. Of course, they also take care of giraffes. That's what I said, you too. Shaw is a bit of a basic name, so. Let's do that name, but yeah. I'm just looking through really quickly to see where it is because usually they'll have posts that are specific to, uh, or at least mention a specific, uh, specific one of their residents that they care for there. Let's see here. Huh. Usually they say when they rescue a new one, they actually say the name. But no, that's because of the fact that it was one that they actually were able to reunite with their moms. I'd say it seems like it's about half-half with uh, Reteti, they're able to uh, reunite their, their uh, these babies they rescue with their mothers, and the other half they're sadly not able to. Right, Kelepo is another one. So, let's go with Kelepo for this youngin over here. Oh, it's a, it's a, it's a goyle, but we're still going to go with it, so. Makes me think of a lumpo, go figure. Kelepo. There you go. By the way, while I'm thinking of it, while I'm recall, I'm gonna put uh, the leaks to two songs. And Reteti in the description, or in the description, in the uh, chat, which clearly YouTube hates me for that. Because it's like, oh, that's too many. Chat of all the things. So that is for two songs. It, according to YouTube, it just shortened it to what looks like one link. See, I've never actually shared, tried to share a bunch of links there before, so I think it only did one link. Yeah, it did. Shut up. Shut up! You little bench. Alright. Oh, you and it's still pl okay. That's beautiful. Good job, Google. You did great. The own bullshit. All right, let me just get to it. And then you can also go into the description, by the way, for this. So, if you'd like to know, do that uh, or go to the links directly. You can that way. Yeah, see, I think what it is, it is that it doesn't like the fact that there's a bunch of other links. Basically, it just because I did enter to paragraph down to each link. So that's going to be the same link. I'm actually going to get rid of the original one. Uh, remove. We're going to do this the long way around. It's pretty exciting stuff. Uh, boom. I discovered two songs via this next which is their uh, Instagram because it's about the only uh, what do you call it I still utilize so uh, social media that's the word I'm looking for because I don't consider YouTube social media so if you're newer here there you go um, yeah I'm kind of old school in a handful of ways anyway when it comes down to tech stuff so like it's like, well, why would you just do the, you know, the long way around? Because, one, I don't want to put in all the effort, and two, <laughs> um, yeah. Two is just the fact that it's easiest for me. That's a wrong link, because, damn it, because I left something in there. I left the R, but I titi, because it's being a 
Because it's being an idiot about it with me. It's being picky. It's like as soon as I go for the R and I go down, it's like, oh, you moved a little too aggressively. I'm going to have to uh, reset your your uh, your copying here. Um, I'm sorry. I can't accept this. Okay. There we go. And then, obviously, therefore, from there, it's going to be Retetti. So, let's go down to... Again, it's in the description for anybody who's watching the VOD as well, but we saw this other thing. That's why the R was there, though. That's why it gives two Retetti at this point. So, Retetti. Uh, this. I'm going to actually do this, because that'll make it a little quicker. Retetti. That. This, uh, do Zerada, which is basically a direct way to donate and help them with that, which is always good. And then, last but not least, their fancy book. There you go. So that I'll link to that, and now I'm going to about the rest of it. But yes, the uh, first two are, or sorry, three links are two songs, and then the other remainders, of course, are Redetti. All right. So let's do that. And then, for two songs, what we're going to do is, if it would allow me back in here, thank you. Uh, we're going to go over to... By the way, uh, the next expansion plan is to start around here. Or potentially go this way. Or here. Basically anywhere within this corner. And expand up this way so we can fill in the middle space. That's the idea is when our next expansion is going to be. Of course it's not going to be today's stream because it's going to be a short to the point stream. Because I have to do a podcast today. Because I've started a podcast recently. There's another freaking spider web. What the? There must be a hash out. It's okay. I'm not an arachnophobe. I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah. So I think what we're going to do now, for I mean, I could go the obvious and go to the dingo dials if I wanted to. Uh, to rename. Couple of these fillers. Hannah. Oh, Hannah. I can't hear you, Hannah. You're not speaking with your puppet. I can't hear you. Should be a predictable way to rename these guys. We're a two song thing because it's Australia. Australia. Same with the ruse. But there is so many ruse, and there's a lot of poop going around here. A lot of shit uh, going down that I could easily rename them. I'm going to rename one of these younger ones, but there should be some that are even younger than that. And I know that for sure because there was a handful that were born fairly recently when I last left off. Although then again, I say that, but I think that was actually at the end of that stream. I don't think that was actually... Uh, during my last play session, which was a few hours long, because I was doing all the boring stuff of all the maintenance that I actually ended up, unfortunately, doing against my plans in the uh, last live stream. So I'm going to go with you, and we're going to name you Miss Molly. So, uh, Miss Molly, and then I believe you were younger. Oh, well, I missed you last night. I'm trying to think of the ruse that they have, because they have a bunch of ruse. I know of Eric, Jimmy, bunch of, oh, Pumpkin. Which is not a, it's not, not a, uh, Rue there, it's a Wombatant. Okay. And, um, you know what? There was one I clicked on, I guess it was you. Yeah, Talia. 
Dari. We have like nothing but women apparently in this place. Molly, or maybe named you. Okay, so we must only have the one dude who just did um. Did um. Alright. It's fine. Uh, let's see. This is the snow leopard habadashere. We only have, I believe, two. Uh, is this the... Is this the main one? Yes, yeah, this is the one. I'd have to go... This way. Right? No, no, this wouldn't be the lemur one, then. No, no, no. That's, I'm doing it all wrong. That's not the real one. This is the dingoes, so... Wait. That's the heffalumps. Is this a habitat? Yeah, okay, this is the lemurs. So this is the, uh, what are they called? Mandrills. A.K.A. the, uh, baboon-looking motherfuckers. Because <laughs> they do look like baboons. Um... Nice noisy brace on my, uh, my table. Dusk, what are we going to consider it? This, therefore, is the lions. The lions. Why are you always lying? But, of course, the one time I actually am looking for them, I can't freaking find them. Like, normally, I'm never looking for them, and you'll always see them somewhere. I guess they're all out of, out in the shirt. Out in, rather, inside of the shade. God damn. So, yeah. But, anyway. Uh, he's on Goit control because there was an alpha fight going on way too frequently, and I was just ignoring it for super long, so... I've never seen them up on this either, but I'm pretty sure I recall, at least when I put it in there, that they supposedly used it as under lions, but I don't think they actually have ever used it. Yeah, so he's definitely the only dude broke. But, uh, likelihood is, if I look at the lineage tree, they're probably... Uh, related. I don't know why I'm not remembering the... I feel like there's one that was named Josie. I don't remember if she's the one who sadly died. I don't think so. But she was having a lot of issues, including prolapsed pouch problems and stuff. Um... Well, there's an easy way to figure out how to remind buying self, and that is to go... Maybe I'm just directly two songs. Two songs! 26 Ruski Doodles and 6 Warm Bats. Of course, you know I gotta name one of them off the word. Throw another one up in Maxi. And probably one after Frankie because of his disability. Life really rough and cute. <laughs> so cute. Oh, uh, let's see. These southern herinous wombats are disgustingly adorable. Actually, I was kind of sad when the Australia D uh, DLC was released and they didn't have wombats in it. I'm like, you can't don't have my enemy wombatins in it? The hell's wrong with you? Specifically, the specifically, specifically, specifically these southern herinous wombats. Those are so cute. Oh my god, they're adorable. They're super rambunctious too. But also like super, super cuddly, but also they will bite your finger off. It's, they're, they're just like the perfect combination of cute cuddliness and adorable, I'm gonna eat you. Yes. Um, let's see. By the way, again, for the record, I'm not doing any of this because I'm like asked to or being like given any money or anything like that for it. They don't even know I'm doing this. I'm just doing it because I wanted to. I've been wanting to do this since pretty much the last stream. I thought about it. I'm like, that's a good idea. Well, that's a really good idea. Um, want to take this outside? Yeah. Wow, this is a really nice evening. This was a really good idea. It's gift references. Um, I don't know why I'm just like flipping through like a mindless moron. But yeah, you can tell that's Eric. Eric the kangaroo there is so laid back. He's he's for, he, he's like a, a stoner if a kangaroo goes as a stoner. Yeah, this is fucking funny. 
Oh, Lila. Lila's one of them. I remember that. I remember that. I'm a member of one of them, and I didn't even see. Uh, Lila. He's like, well, you have nothing but, uh, oh, you know, like a bunch of kangaroos. Why would you not name one of them that if it's after a room? Because I like to break the rules. Yes, we'll name the one that's taking a shit. <laughs> Nomble. There's a name. I am Venom. Oh, let's see. Nelly! That's another one of them. The youngsters. Gorgeous kids. <laughs> Zing! Oh, let's see. I don't know why, I still have like a little bit of anxiety sometimes when I do things, so like, when I do my voice acting like that, I'll just like, I can feel the blood rush to my cheeks, like, oh, it's embarrassing, it shouldn't be, but it is for some reason. Let's see, good golly, Miss Molly. Portals? That's Lila. So cute, so fuzzy. Uh, it's definitely a pumpkin. Da, da, dum. <laughs> um, God damn, man. Oh, yeah, Dorothy as well. Dorothy. Getting all the wombats. The wombat ladies. They say that actually Dorothy is a... A Ruski. But it's all the youngsters. I wanted to do one of the long tenured ones that they've had. But uh Lila is also one of the youngsters, so it's like ah, I didn't think there's that many posts since the last time I saw it. <laughs> oh no. Um Those giant teddy bears that you can get from IKEA too, uh at some point one of the people who donate to two songs actually got uh Miss Molly, one of those. Oh, man. And, uh, my god, she loved just tackling that thing. Getting all feisty about it. Majestic Maxi is another one I should name one up. Another critter after, because Maxi's so talkative. Oh, yeah, Basil. EB. Ibrina, that's one I definitely should name one, uh, uh, one for sure, because, yeah, I believe she's the one who passed, one of the youngsters. Ibi, aka Ibrina, which is a, uh, aboriginal name. I, they said at some point what it meant, and I wish I remembered. It was something fairly simple. But beautiful, of course. Gracie, that was one of the older ones I was trying to think of. Based out of Port Lincoln. That's the other thing I was trying to figure out and think of. <laughs> That's adorable. My cousin just sent me a gif. That's adorable. Alright, uh, Ibrina. I might have put the transfix the I and R because I'm dyslexic. Hembadoon. That sounds like a future Pokemon character. Hembadoon. Uh, what is her name? Gracie. Actually, you know what? Fuck that. I'm gonna keep that as Hembadoon. I'm gonna go back to the Ruskies. I feel like I don't know why, but I get the strong urge to be like, you know what? I need to, I need to name one of these Rus properly. Like, make it a Ru name. Uh, for Gracie, and so I shall do that. There we go. And like, I have a bunch of old sheep. I mean, they just multiplied like rabbits. Once I put them in there, they just go off. And it's like, all right. I know I got rid of a lot. I think I got rid of a lot of them. But I'm not actually, now that I think about it, I don't actually know. And I still have a lot. Quite a few indeed. Um, Zoe, actually. Imminent. Huna. To find the youngest one again, Jukonga, London, Heathrow. 
20. I'll go. Uh, oh, cool. It's like a burp that's not actually coming. Help. Um, Abigail. I do like that name for some reason. That, that's a name that recently, in recent years, has started to grow on me. I have no idea why. How was you then? Alright. Kiana? Kiana. 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 Um. The freaking alpha status of freaking uh, wild animals, man, is actually kind of annoying because now that I think about it, it means that like 90% of the animals I have are probably female. Um, I have two dude bros, I guess. I should just call them that. That's not the one I wanted. Uh, just call them that. Just that. Would you get out of my wife? Um, Abigail, where the heck were you? Santi, Patrice, help, uh, London Heathrow, here we go. The youngster's already the alpha, huh? Errol, let's see. Uh, you know what? I was gonna say Wardy Woo, which is what a lot of people call him, but Waldo! Why not? Uh, Jaconda or Jaconda? Jaconda? Jaconda, probably. Probably more Euro, Euro influence, but imagine. But I don't know. Maybe it is Jaconda. Strange name, I know. Uh, this is the Gorillas. Because it's clearly Spanish and definitely not English. Ocopai. Very oversized and too Ocopai, but it is. It is nothing. What am I, what was I thinking of? I don't know, that's a good question. There was something specifically I was thinking of that I wanted to rename, but I don't remember what it was. Uh, I'm keeping track of my head really well. My head's slipping from me right now. All right, no, that's not the one I want. That's the snow leopards. What am I thinking of right now? This is the lemurs, mandrails. Owns. Oh, right, 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 I know I was already this person already. I want to go to here. Uh, and we have some Lizzie Lews. In fact, it was exactly the Zimonstials I was looking for. Gila Monstials. We've had them for quite a while, but I'm going to rename Yasin. Hassin. Gila. So Hassin. Hassin Monsters. Although Gila is spelled, it said Gila. You know it's a G, but it's actually J in Spanish. But yeah, I don't know. Anyway, um, let's go with Maxi, the majestic Maxi Kleber. It's the only person I know of that has that name of Maxi in that way is uh, Maxi Kleber or Kleber. Look at your yellow and candles. Yellow and that's not so yellow and candles. Look at them. Aren't they so majestic? Social health. Uh oh. Ow! So that's too many already? Sweet, sweet. I love it. It's the best. Yeah. Wonderful, my darling. Also, they're wonderful. I'm pretty sure Violetta, however, I want to say is one of the OGs, but I don't actually know. Maybe Catalina is the younger one. Oh, she is. Okay, my bad. Um, well, then we'll take care of that right now, which, I guess you can't adopt them out. You can only send them to Trade Center. Oh, no, seems racist. Uh, let's see, and then, Amido, Amidio is definitely the younger one, yeah. Point. There he goes, so he was the one that met. Mm -hmm. This must be, I'm assuming this is probably Javier, not, uh. Violetta, but I do not know. Uh, I'm being an idiot. Let's, well, let's see. Javier. No idea why. I just figured that was Javier, but that was right. All right. So there's that. Crap. 
You only have one kiddo. Come on, now. Don't be like that. Gustavo Leon. Uh... <laughs> Wonder how many people are gonna even know who the heck Gustavo Leon was or is, I should say. Okay, yeah, Marco. Oh, Marco. Uh, Marco was the, uh, the bro. Dolores is nine and a half, and I believe they have a decent lifespan, like at least twenty. So, Gustavo Leon, have fun. But yes, I don't answer. God damn, these frogs don't stop. They just do not cease their reproduction, and they're always producing whammons. Jeez. Well, no, I know I can release these guys to the, uh, the, the vibes. So... It's not even that, it's this, and then this. Uh, exhibits. Freaking layman's terms, I believe is the way it was, and it wasn't exhibit. It really has to be under animals. Well, that's bull. Le layman's poison, poison, frag. Um, dum dum dee dum. Let's see. All right, Imelda. Yeah, they see this is the way you do it. Don't know why it has to be so gosh darn picky, but it thinks it does. Felicidad. Uh, Perry. One point seven years of age. Leticia. Juanita. And Francisco. Release to violence. In the box. Still. <laughs> Too many. You know, it's almost impossible to properly manage the freaking frogs. I swear to dog. Not the frogs. This is the fr This is Lehman's terms over here, sir. This is the one I want anyway. I can't really do what I want to do with it. Four and four, and that's still considered too large. Wow! I mean, basically, I'm running an incidental breeding program at that point, then. What a shame. What a pity. What a gone down time, isn't it? Uh, let's see. Sound. Uh, Lemons. Hey, some fig. I mean, they're okay, but they still appear not too large of a grub. Now we have two, two, four, six, so we'll get rid of them. Oh, there's have two Felicidads too, so this is actually perfect. Um, mainly perfect. You're still okay with your elderly, so we'll keep you around. Diego. Alexia. Uh, Innova. And then I'm gonna keep the oldest, and I'm gonna keep the youngest of the women's, and then same with the dude ones. So we're gonna get rid of Mario, you know, I prefer that name. Or a lot of the other ones, because they haven't even seen that one yet. And I'm gonna save the oldest one. Because you wouldn't really have any use out in the world anyway. So we have to get to rid of Martin Moreno, and I guess that's what we're doing. Release to bias. Sweet! Alright. Now they should be okay for like two minutes in game time. Oh gosh dang them. Load, load. Loud, I say loud. Give me the strength. Huh. 
Hi kids, Kermit the Frogs here. We are all Kermit in spirit. Uh, so, you know, something I've learned recently is that as a frog, I can really proliferate at an extremely excessive copulation, uh, you know, in, in, that, in that regard. And I realize, you know, this kind of scares me. Hello! So, you know, kids, basically the idea is don't get too hormonally excited. You might end up uh, in too grave a number and make yourself extremely sick. This is being Kermit, the poison dart frog. I appreciate you. But we're gonna pretend he is. Poison dart frog! No. Uh, anyway. Renard tree frame. Aeroids. Here we go. <laughs> We go killing again. Uh, tree frig. Guppy. I haven't even paid enough attention to these guys to realize what I've done. What have I done? Then again, these might be the only ones I've added recently. Off, uh, off stream. So, let's see here. Yep. You, you. Even though you're younger. And younger behaves. Uh, you and you. Just one hunt. And then I'll be the oldest. I'm the oldest of the dude drugs, so actually. Uh, you. You and you. And then. All of our whammons are pretty old. Let me see. So that's good. Um. Da -da -de so that's how many ones? Three? And then, no pun intended. And I just realized. And then, uh, uh pull the dude ribs. That's the four. I can mount. White can mount. Takes a little too long to do. Of the elders. So we'll get rid of you two. Beautiful. Really? Wunderbar. Look at the Antian in the Vinci bar. You're only gonna really see if you're over here. You can see clearly now the Lizzie's here. Nice fat and very plump. Nice <laughs> fat. Uh, let's see. It's important to be plump, otherwise it just wouldn't be fun. Oh god. Okay, that's a bit close. <laughs> that's what he's saying. Okay, uh, let's see. Uh, you are the layman's Thames. I've already touched ye, right? Yes, because you're the yellow anacondas. You are, I don't know why I'm speaking like I'm Northeastern. How are you guys doing? You're fine. These are other ones I recently put in, I believe it was these guys, right? No, actually no, it was these guys. Uh, the f Stop breeding! The world copulation review is excessive. Oh no, it's just that there's one too or no, two too many. They actually aren't going excessively. But then again, given the level of, or the time that it's, they've even been in the zoo. This is a lot. African. Would you? African. Ford. Why not? That's their full name. It's actually a Goliath frog in general. I believe they are African. I'm confusing with that. African, what is the full name of that toad I'm thinking of? It's a hey freaking something toad. Uh, Goliath Frey, which I believe are in fact half of it. Uh, you. Fuck it. Better put the environment that way. I don't know why I have an urge to name one of these guys Quasimodo. I don't know why. <laughs> Uh, this is the other one, I think, that I added recently, or was it over here? 
No, it was definitely you. Which was the other folders. Which is the Mexican Red King Tarantula. Alert! It's I don't know why that's an alert. Leticia. Latanya. Latoya. Jeremiah. Jermaine. <laughs> uh, let's see. Just like the cliche American white people, the uh, inner black community of America also has just as cliche names for themselves. <laughs> for their children, I think I see one up here. <laughs> Keen eye for the spodep. Spiderman. The mom. Uh, who, huh, why are you so sensitive? God damn it, I just, I just, I gotta go wash something. Well, this is a pain in the arse of this. Uh, anyway. Look at that smile. Aren't they looking lovely today with those eyes? Tarantula. Aeroid. Beautiful. Wonder. Hey. But that wasn't the point of why I was doing this. The point was I wanted to rename one or two of them as another one representative of the uh, sanctuaries. So, I only named somebody after the ma Majestic Maxi. Oh my god, how did I not notice her right there? Violeta, how did I not notice you? That is wonderful, I love that. Uh, I want to go back up. Uh, 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 I should be able to go up. God damn it. Here we go, oh god. Hello, Hild. Look at her. Oh, good. So sensitive. I love it. Um. The problem is, in this mode, you can't actually go and get rid of the UI. There is no feature in the game for that, which is really freaking dumb. Because if they're if they're was a feature, I would have seized it by now. But instead. Stop! Lordy, lordy. Wait, let me go and just here. See, sometimes it's really sensitive and other times it's not. And I have no idea why. It's not like I'm holding the key any longer than the others. But yeah, so like if I went like this, and all it does is it is like, hey, it's, she's right here. Cool, but that doesn't really do what I wanted it to. You know, which is just. Oh, what? Uh, it's like super finite too. Like. I guess that's a, probably a part of it, was uh, my rotation's not quite peachy keen enough. Oh, yeah, that, there's a really up-close portrait. But I can't get rid of the UI! Complaints? Worst game ever! Doesn't give me exactly everything I want. I'm burning my computer now. Yeah. But, Violetta, you look luxurious today, I must say. Very beautiful, my dear. Very beautiful. And yes, I know that's the camera controls down here, but I fucked with that for... Quite a while. Doesn't get rid of the UI. And I've looked, I spent, I did that, I think I did this in the last live stream, in fact. I spent like, somewhere between probably 20 and 40 minutes straight, just like, hunting around every possible menu. There's nothing there. All right, so Dingo Dials. Uh, right. We have a pup that I believe matured recently. So of course we have to keep Dingo Dial. As a name. It's just sacrilege without it. Ryan. Does they want an airline that lands really hard? <laughs> God damn it. This is what it's like living with me. I don't I don't miss not making terrible jokes that even I can't laugh at. Um what are we doing? Yeah. Who shall we name it after? Let's go with Yeah. 
You know, if I have, if I'm gonna name it after one, though, I'd love to name it after Eric. I think I'm gonna have to name it after, um, what's his face? Frankie, because Frankie has that disability that he's gonna sadly have to live with for his whole life. Frankie, you've been honored, my dear enemy wombatant. Much praise to your face. But see, now, if I do, uh, then I don't have any UI. But it's the only way the game allows, that's actually really good, not great lighting, but really good, uh, only allows a UI. Still not great lighting. That's with it not applied, but this is with it applied. I'm pretty sure the camera edge being darker would be the vignette, but... Oh god! Hell! Um. Let's see. La -da -da -da. I spend way too much time getting screenshots in this game anyway. So yeah, the camera light's on. However, it doesn't really change much in the lighting situation. So considering it seems like the light must be really low. And I don't know why. But yeah. Hey, freaking man, my other dorks. And, you know, as we all know, zebras are clearly indigenous and endemic to Australia. If you question that, you're just wrong because this is the internet and therefore everything said here is canon. And uh, you're a brochure in the book if you question it. Oh, wait, this isn't Twitter? Damn it. Alright, well, anyway, there you go. So, I renamed some after two songs as... Wait, we have four? Lots of news to me, buddy. This is Violeta. Taking a nice dump. Now, sometimes that's really... Gives you a lot of relief. Oh, no, I'm just dumb. Because... No, we do have four. Yeah, because, no, I Hannah. Uh, I can't stop thinking of freaking what about Bob. Whenever I say Hannah. No, damn it. Oh wait, so are we at five? Oh yeah, Sophie. My bad, I'm an idiot. I forgot that we had Sophie. Did I name her Sophie? Or was that autopilot? I can't remember. Whoops. Uh, <laughs> yeah, five. How did I not know that? What the hell, man? No, we have six. Or is that, am I counting right? Yeah. Oh, we do have a pup. Still. Thomas. Right. Actually, no, no. You know what? Before I go, excuse me. I uh. What? I selected Thomas, didn't I? Let's dingo dial himself. Uh, crashing racing everybody. He's he's real. And he's in my Z. Coming up to them. <laughs> oh wait, that was dumb. Okay, there we go. Nice. Let's use that to get the poi near. Adorable. What a cute bumper. Schnuffer up. Bumper up. Woofer top. Something. Also. Absolutely. You actually have to turn it back off again if you want. Uh, if you want to have it. Unfortunate lad. So, this is one of my. There. Yeah. Okay, so what was the thing I was thinking of? I was thinking of what before I actually. White before. White, white before I actually go. Uh, right before I actually go, because uh, I'm a professional, I know how to speak. Um, I wanted to go to. Thank you, I appreciate the contribution. And yours, I do. Thank you. Um, frick. My brain is like acting like it has no fuel for some reason suddenly. Les Mues. Les Mues. I knew it was basically next door and it actually literally technically is next door. Um, this took eternity to be able to get the social group back to normal. Uh, for the, the lemurs. Les Mues. 
I mean, it just took forever. And it's kind of annoying. Um, it took all of the last stream, which if you look, it's like three, no. It's like just over three and a half hours in length. And like, this was one of the things that was haunting me through it. And then it took me beyond that, because then the next day, I was still fiddling with it to try to fix it. And then right as it finally starts to level out, Zabumafu died. And I'm like, oh man. So, we don't have a Zabumafu anymore. <laughs> I didn't fix it. God damn it. It's a, see, I feel like this is partially a bug, though, because, like, I can't win with it. Like, before, I had twice as many lemurs in here that I do right now, and it was at 100%. It was perfectly fine, because they need, a, they need quite a big social group. But then, I give them so far down to where it's like I went from like having at the, at the peak which I admit definitely probably would have been too many um let's see really quick uh adult population is only three get it saying it's crowded and that's for them so how many do we actually have we have four Four of the of the ring neck, uh, the ring neck, uh, the ruffed, red ruffed flamer, uh, and then for the ring tailed we have three. Yet it still complains that there seems to be crowding issues. So they need a lot more social, but then they complain about that. And say that they don't, they have too much crowding issues. Or an insufficient amount of area. So, I guess if it was instead actually the area problem, which it definitely was social before. If it was the area problem, then in theory what happened is they probably reprogrammed? Habitable climbing area. Claims it's 0 out of 517. Which is untrue. So no, it is a bug. Because the amount of, like, I added... So much climbing stuff, as you can tell, like climb. Everything here is climbable area. Trees, I added tons more trees for climbable area. So they have a bunch of trees they can climb. Um, a bunch of climbing stuff that they didn't have before. And that fixed the climbing. But that's not a social issue, that's a habitat issue. So like, there has... No, yeah, so it, it, it would have had to have been that if I go to the Zoopedia, an example, um, which I'm not entirely sure how exactly you get to a Zoopedia, um, unless you go to animal trading, basically. So, uh, let's go to ring-tailed lemur, the actual Zaboomafoos. Uh, let's see here, and then this is the only one I have to Wikipedia, so we can do this. Two thousand. Um. Okay. Three to thirty. Three to thirty. So that's fine. If we look at what they require for area. Go up to three adults because that's what there is right now. Only 301 climbable area. Land area is 2433 square feet. And if you've ever had much experience with this game, or even me and anything I've done with this game, you know that I have a habit of overdoing every habitat ever and like excessive future prep. Um, in terms of, like, the total area and total size of the, um, the habitat, which, uh, it should be listed somewhere in here, maybe maintenance. Toss, this is these guys. Oh, 
Oh, right here. Okay. 47,189. That doesn't include the water area within it, which is 5,716. And average water depth is 4.1. Four, 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 four feet, basically. Which, that's both a habitat and a social issue, supposedly. Social because the smaller it is, the more, you know, the more of them there are, the more space they're going to need. That's common sense. Obviously, it's going to be that way. But as we can see, three ringtails only need 2,500 square feet. We go to the ring next, right? Because, see, they have exactly the same claim. They're probably going to be something similar, if not exactly the same. So let's go and get rid of this, and then go for uh, Red Rock Lemur. Go to Zapedia. And then, oh, that's a lot more than the ring tail. Oh, that's actually kind of sad. And definitely, but yeah, see, same thing. 3 to 30. 3 to 30. We do four, 2,500 square feet again. And 3,344. There's more than enough space for them at that point. So if we go here, it claims there's zero out of 517 uh, navigable climbing area. I, again, as you can see, there's a countless places they can climb because they did that off camera. Because it claimed that that was a problem. So I'm like, okay, I'll add even more. And I went in such excess just to shut it up. And it literally showed me, oh, you have this much excess of climbable area. Great. Perfect. Problem. <laughs> the climbable area, which I don't know where the hell that's supposed to be listed in this. Unless it's only listed when you go to build with it. For some reason. Um, like, God, I don't get it. Let's see. Um, it should tell me, but I don't know why it's not telling me. I guess it's only available if I go into like building. So habitat, and then we'll go into here, and let's just do this for an example um or this or actually you know what because these kapulks are more than climbable an example like they can climb those that's a that's a climbable tree so if we do um Not sure how actually that works. Trees. Then we do climbable. Nope. I don't know how the heck I'm supposed to get to specifically look for climbables then. Um, but basically, a local pine tree. Because uh, it'd be under tags. Obviously, that's that's the oh, climbable. Now I see non-grid prop. Which I don't think I've seen before when I'm going through all this. Um, some of these should say climbable. Unless that's part of what it is, what that means is that the, one of these updates, they changed that again. And now it's like, oh, they don't climb that. They just have climbing fit props. And it's non-grid prop. Now here we go, climbable. Boom. There you go. So, um, I have no idea what belongs where. That's probably South American. Uh, for, like, Africa. I know the Pokes work for that. Hookthorn Acacias work. That makes sense. So, so like, uh, let's just go with this, right? Just as an example. Boom. 
There, I give them a climbable tree that probably isn't to their environment. Technically, that's a climbable area. Um, I'm not sure where the heck I'm missing the climbability though, when I'm actually looking at habitat. But, uh, maybe that's part of what happened? Is they updated it again and said, well, these don't climb, as I mean, they're climbables, but they don't count as climbable terrain or something. I don't know, like, I, I got the feedback somewhere that they had a bunch of climbable terrain. It probably was on one of these guys. But, uh, 0 15. Like, it has to be a bug. Because I can't, I can't. Yeah, see, look. I just put one thing in there. 3,132 feet. So I guess maybe every single time I load into the game, I'm gonna have to put another thing down for a climbable area for it to count. That's the best thing I can think of. Yeah, so now, now it's 100%, so it's a climbability issue. So it has to be a bug. It absolutely has to be. I don't understand why that's, that's that way. But it is quite annoying, because that means if it, this happens again, I need to be reminded about that, because it'll be quick and easy for me to just mm -hmm. do deal with that at that point. Uh, so we only have three ring tails. The point here was, before I left off, which I'm already taking away longer than I meant to, uh, to rename, that's Bolana again. What are the odds of me intestinally clicking on Bolana? Um, Oletina, Oletiana. It's not as difficult as I'm making out of it. Social group. Two. <gasps> Another one died? What's the lady balloons? Also, this. This keeps happening. I have way more than enough in the work area. I have way more enough than enough staff in general, including excess that just don't have a work area. Doesn't matter. Like, there'll always be at least one that's just like, uh, you know, it's been without somebody for a really long time. Tiana died. Oh, no. So I exclusively have had, I should say, um, females, which is always exciting. So, ring tail. Or, the tail and postage. What I could do, instead. I know I actually did get a reward at some point, but whatever. Uh, let's just. He hides you. Uh, let's see. Alright, let's do this. I don't believe I have a dude. I think I only have women in this too, so I'll just do. It's not the greatest. Um, no, that's baboon looking motherfuckers. I don't want to accidentally uh, <laughs> put them in with the lions. <laughs> I can see how well that would work. Nice. We get a spam bot. That's the only actual chat message I get this time. Nice. My favorite. Um, yeah. All right. Go for ringtail, please. Go. No. Uh, Joro again. Let's see. This is fertility and immunity. Immunity is not great, but immunity is bad on you too. And longevity is the more important one for survival. So, we're gonna go with you, dude. But we're also gonna rename you. Because it's a food. I have to always have a permanent Zabuma boot. Because if we don't, sacrifice. Alright. Eleven years. She's up there, man. Oops. Um. Okay, that was funny. These aren't the worst traits, but. Get a few more of them. 
And uh, I don't want an overpopulation problem. But I'm kind of thinking I want to get another type of emulator. So <laughs> he's tiny. I love it. Right, obviously, he's the best genetic. So we're gonna use you. Access right now. Well, that's fine. Um, making sure I'm looking at it correctly. Here we go. All right, so let's go here, here, and then let's. Sometimes it can take quite a while for them to show up. Uh, let's go for... I wish the mechanic would actually fix, fix it rather than waiting to a certain point like that. Alright, there we go. Nice. So obviously I want you to be peak food quality. Perkinant. <laughs> uh, let's see. You? Let's just Perkinant for one. Alright. You. We got our name, you boy. Although I need to get that. <laughs> Alright. This was one of my actually favorite experiences going to the Oregon Zoo uh, last year for the video, the videos actually that I did, uh, because I absolutely, I absolutely adore uh, these these critters. They're so cute. Oh my god! Even their habits are just the sweetest, most adorable things, including like interaction with kids. They love to interact with kids. It's so cute. Oh my god, they're adorable. Like, super curious, you can tell they're always thinking, trying to figure things out, just tell them how they're so Even the ways that they sit are just the most overwhelming, like, adorable, disgusting, like, offensively adorable things. Oh, uh, Zaboobafu! Zaboobafu. <laughs> it's the budget Zaboobafu, you find a Dollar Tree. Zaboobafu! And there we go, we have our second Zaboobafu. Actually, you know what? I probably should demarcate. Uh, There's a boomer for My is a boomer for it. over there. Uh, you know, really shy. There we go. But that was the goal. That was the aim for today. He has like. I love the look on his face because he has this very cat like look on his face. Like, look at that. That's a smug ass look on his face. Like, yeah, I know you're there. But I'm still better than you, so like, why do I pay attention to you? Whatever, dude. You're beneath me. <laughs> That's that face. That is 100% that face, and I love it. <laughs> Such a cat like face. I, I love ring tail lemurs, man. They're so freaking cute. It's disgusting. Anyway. That's the goal, that's the focus of today's videos. More than done with a little bit extra dealt with along the way. And there ain't nothing wrong with that. All right, so we're gonna go over here. I love though, actually, you know what? This is great. Look at all these lemurs on here. They're all climbing up on here. We got a ringtail. We got all three of our uh, black and white ruffed and we got uh, two of our, um, Red Ruffed. That is so cool. But hey, technically this is an episode where we added to our animals with these guys. So, 
Oops, I keep I, I I'm always premature on my my click my curricular actions. I swear, like, every minute I look over there, there's, like, for, like, three seconds, there's two concurrent viewers, and then immediately goes back down to one. Somebody's either, like, constantly joining and leaving, or... I don't know. These critters are majestic. Look at them. Majestic individuals. Oh, actually, I like this angle, because... Look at them. Yeah, I like this angle. Like here? Uh, close, because then it gives just slightly more room on the left hand side, which then leaves the room for the Planet Zoo live thing I do. And then for thumbnails, and then this one because of the light shaft over him. But also because not only does it leave that space in the upper left hand corner, but at the same time, now you get both of them. He's looking directly into the camera, which is fantastic. I love that. But alright, there you go. So, with that dealt with, actually I didn't have to do that, but yeah. I'm going to leave you with this, and I will see you in whatever the heck my next uh, video or live stream is. I still have plenty of 7 days today to give out. Um, I have been like planning other things and then they keep going through, which is really fun. Uh, so that's why it's kind of falling behind, that is what it is. I'll see you all uh, later. Thank you for joining, and uh, please be sure to check out the links in the description below. I'll probably put them in comments as well, or a, yeah, a comment as well, so that you guys have two different ways to access the floating, floating stuff. Uh, access the links to Two Song Sanctuary pages as well as Reteti, because they deserve all the help they can get. I would say, I mean, if you had to prioritize one, I would probably say two songs because it's literally ran by just a middle-aged couple by themselves. And they've been doing it for years. And so literally they rely on donations to be able to help them out and word of mouth. So they have a lot of ruse. They have 16 ruse, I think, on hand right now. And they also, of course, have, uh, I believe, five or six? Six. They have six wombats. And they actually have a few horses too. So, you're gonna probably wanna go ahead and do that. But with that said, I'll see you a little bit. And I'll leave you with this for a few minutes to conclude the stream. Stay safe out there. Enjoy yourselves. I'll see you later.